Hey guys, Sandy here, and I am back with my Secret Not Secret Kit Club kit for the month of November. And remember, my kits come at the end of the month, so I will be working with the November kit, hopefully through December. We'll see how much scrapping actually gets done with this kit, because I am doing December daily this year. Um, so we'll see how much of this scrapping gets done, but fingers crossed. Okay, I already read my card. <laughs> And then here we go into the kit. And you know what? Every month I'm like, oh, oh save the tissue. I just want to tear into this bad boy. Okay, we are torn into this bad boy and it is stuck to me. Alrighty. We'll get the tissue out of the way and let's see what we can see. I'm already seeing some exciting things. All right, we're gonna start with the papers. And I'll put this off to the side. You can see my messy craft mat here. All righty, these are beautiful papers. Okay, so we have Find Your Wings and Fly with this chevron. And on the other side is this kind of scallopy looking thing. And this is from My Mind's Eye. Love this. Then we have, yay, we have a cut file from Kaisercraft, and it is the Summer Splash Collection. So that's exciting. You can see that. And then we have from One Canoe to Creekside. And then these trees. Oh my goodness, I love these trees. I love these trees. This is beautiful, but these trees just make me happy, so we're going to put that one up. Okay, then we have this paper from Crate Paper Journey, and this is teepees and little trees and um, signs. And then on this paper is kind of this yellow and cream diamond pattern. Then we have another creek side, and this is a cut apart sheet. We have some banners and some tags, journaling, some strips. And then on the other side is a polka dot. I love this polka dot, but some of these, like these, make me so happy. These strips right here. I think what I'll do is end up using some of the polka dot and some of this. We have this um, Capture Life from Echo Park and I, um, I've i had a couple sheets of this and sometimes I use this side, sometimes I use this side, so who knows what side we're gonna use this time. And then here are some uh, sheets from the paper pads. I have these arrows here. And then, yay, it's a small world paper. Okay, so this paper right here So you're getting a peek at a layout that I did and it's up on my channel. So when I saw this paper, the first thing I thought was it looks like dandelions with these leaves. The second thing I thought was this reminds me of the ride It's a Small World at the very end. So I have a layout that I created with this paper because it reminds me of It's a Small World. So, hooray! So now I will try to do something else fun with this one. And that is exciting. And then we have this paper, and this is from Fancy Pants Happy Go Lucky. And it's tickets on this side, which would be awesome to cut apart or use a section off. And then this great paper on the side here. Okay, so those are the papers, and I'm loving them. Okay, so we have these thickers, and these are stylist. They're a larger thicker, and they're in gray. And I have to say, I do love gray um, thickers. I actually have gray fun foam right on my desk because it's one of the colors that I use to cut out thickers with. Okay. Then we have the Creekside One Canoe Two sticker sheet, and there are some stars, hearts, and circles some banners, um, tiny words and phrases, more banners and circles. 
Then we have the Illustrated Faith Hearts. I love these hearts. Um, Bella Boulevard makes some awesome hearts. They're a favorite, and this color is fantastic. I don't have this color. Then we have some label stickers from Collecting Moments from Fancy Pants. Oh, sorry. I pulled that up so I could read it, not so you guys could. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, so there we have some great label stickers there. Then this, I'm not exactly sure what these came from, but they're a nice thick sticker and they're white, so I'm assuming I could paint or watercolor or something on them. So we have those. Then we have the 6x6 six six papers. These great little cut-aparts. I love cut-aparts in 6x6 six six size. Then we have this fun chevron. Then we have these look like triangles. And then this craft on like a light cream diagonal. And then this paper right here, which I had a 12 by 12 sheet of and love this color. And it's, it's so thick, it feels like there's two. Okay. So those are the six by six papers. Put those there too. Okay, got some lovely doilies. A couple of those. These, I love this doily, okay. Then the mixed media element, which I get every month. It got some Dina Wakely Heavy Body Acrylic Paint in Sterling, which is awesome. I don't have any of um, her paints. And then, oh, you guys can't really see it if it's up there. And then a Distress Crayon in Brush Pewter. And this is exciting to me. I've wanted some Distress Crayons, but have not taken the plunge and bought my own. So this is awesome. And then I have two little embellishment baggies, and I love the shake. Okay, we'll do the non-shake one first. So open this bad boy up. Make sure I got everything. Yep. Okay, so we have some die cuts. Hello Sunshine, some little florals, Explore, some banners, Smile, some more florals, Go Outside and Play, Trees, Love, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Fun Day, LAX, and more of these great florals. I'm already thinking like what I wanna do with that one. Okay, some more tags and tags that say family and right now. So those are the die cuts. And then the shaky bag. Yay, shaky bag. Okay, so I'm super, super excited about this. So we have some wood veneer that is half painted then we have some flare and I saw this flare in my sneak peek this one and I was like oh I love this I, I scrapbook a lot of airplane photos so yay I love this flare batch then this little Polaroid camera and also one that says summer um, this one might not get used this month just because I tend to scrap chronologically and I'm wrapping up 2016 and I don't want to get way into 2017 before I do that. So we'll see. Then this um, silver charm that says love. And then these bad boys right here, which I am super stoked about. They are these little metal silver hearts. Look at those, they're, they're gorgeous. Okay, so that is my kit for the month of November. I'm super excited to scrapbook with this. I'm really, really excited over this kit. Like super, I can't even tell you. I want to scrapbook it now. I still have a little bit left from my October kit, so I'm going to see what I can get finished um, with that one and then a kit 
and layout share will be up on my channel. All right, I will see you guys soon, and uh, thanks for watching.